Pick uh, was basically uh, an icon for industrial development in the uh, southern part of India. Notable amongst that was in the fertilizer industry. This is the most crucial part of our business, uh, fertilizer vertical, because we are dealing with the food security of India. SPIC is the first company in the group in 1969. And after that, the petrochemical business or semiconductor, logistics. So it all started with SPIC. SPIC is the lifeline of the group. Wherever today people who have had a touch point with SPIC, the recall name of SPIC is uh, very high. And they could be in India, they could be anywhere in the world. But we also became a bit of an affected party with debt. I would say the, the, the most difficult time we had was when our assets were uh, almost uh, auctioned off. So when I joined in 2007, there was an issue that we went for some expansion and projects and those projects have, haven't done well. It was a challenge, it was a journey, but I must say this journey would not have been completed without the promoter support. That was the time when I had this opportunity to participate in changing this icon into something for the future. AM International was used as a catalyst, trying to readjust from the past to the future. So we started to act quickly. This is a promoter who stood by the company in the bad time and really supported it to the hilt. Of course, it was not a smooth ride. You know, I had to manage the expectations of a lot of stakeholders. So we had only one choice, uh, do or die. <laughs> and we fixed it. And we can see a sea change. Today, the young generation, young engineers are joining in droves. And this all is a result of how the promoter stood by the company and this company risen again back like a phoenix. Spic has wonderful facilities of Spic and urea plants and ammonia plant is one of the largest single stream plant in Asia and urea is one of the largest single stream plant in the world. The group uh, has not only been in fertilizers but long ago we were also in the automotive industry. The two wheelers you see are uh, Lambretta scooters produced by one part of the family. So the ships you see were ships that were owned by Spick. We are not uh, new kids on the block. <laughs> We've been around for quite some time. So we know, we know how it works. The township that Spick created uh, several decades ago uh, is a standing example of how uh, you know, the company has given back. Whatever happens, people are most important. An institution or a company has no life without its people. Today you can see that the township supports uh, housing, supports education, supports medical. The entire township you have close to around 926 houses and close to around 3,000 people are living in the township, which is about two kilometers from the plant. We have unique combination of a, a very, very passionate promoter and a very, very passionate workforce. Because of that small downturn and challenge this group has seen around 10, 15 years back, what we need to do uh, continuously is cost consciousness, fiscal prudence and innovation. So a lot more to catch up. So we are going at a breakneck speed on our projects. SPIC is like a lifeline for all the like employees. To grow with SPIC, that's why I can tell you. SPIC is going to grow. I have one message to share on the 50th anniversary and going forward. All we have to do is to create an organization that will forever be trusted by the society. I have heard the founder chairman saying that this team of people, they do not work for me, they work with me. And that is how everybody is treated in SPIC.